Hey everybody, and welcome to another Disney Cars Diecast review. The reason why I paused for a moment was because the new update thing on our phone, yes guys, it has changed. OS update 14.0.1 for the iPhone. And now instead of the little red dot going in in a flash and then going out in a flash, yeah, that's not there anymore, unfortunately. It's like the red bar now with like the hours, the minutes, and the seconds on there. Anyways, off of that, and let's get more on track with metallic haul and gas so he is in case L along with M I believe which case M contains the super chase metallic transforming Elaine McQueen if you know what I'm talking about and the last case of the year case N is going to include metallic snot rod Hudson Hornet with Tire, Silver Raul, mm. oh yeah, and Slider Petrolski. So that's going to be a fun case, because I've been waiting for like, pretty much the entirety of 2020 for him to be released. So anyways, let's take a look at his card art. Hall and Gas, we got this card art last year in the Dynaco 400 series when he was released from Thailand. Special Metallic Edition right there. In case you're wondering, the seller was Get Me Collectibles. Yeah, he's a really trustworthy seller. So, on the back of the Scavenger Hunt, you get Metallic Union Jack Ramone, Metallic Cal Weathers, Metallic Jonas Carvers, and Metallic Brand New Meter, which I need to get Metallic Brand New Meter, because I do not have him. But although I do have Hydraulic Florida Ramon, yeah, he was another recent one that I got. In terms of acquisitions, along with Ben Dordan, yes. As you may know, I got, I have, ugh. Never mind. We're just going to dive right into metallic hauling gas. So we're going to open him up and compare him to a few other metallic cars, which are the metallic piston cut racers, which that'll be fun. He is the second Cars 1 piston cut racer to be released in metallic, though. Ryan Shields being the first in Blue Desert. Right, and there's also the new... That was also the first new release to Blue Desert, which I find ironic. No, not the card art, not the card art. Phew, saved it the best. Wow, Hall looks pretty stellar so far. It looks better than I thought he would out of the package. Whoa. My lag. All right. So, let's take a good look at him. Oh, yeah, he appeared in the Pista Cup races scenes of the Dynaco 400. Yeah, the Pista Cup race scenes of the Dynaco 400. I remember one scene, though, he crashed into Billy Oil Changer and James Clean Air. Yeah, but let's not get there now. We're going to take a look at him. So, here's the front of him. The metallic purple is a little bit different on the eye shadow right there. To be honest, that just looks like China's paintwork. It almost looks like a silver car. That's if I get used to like the purple or lavender or something. It looks kind of silver. Not even a purple. Off camera, but it may look like a purple on camera. 
Nice, he did the little metallic purple. Across the purple stripes. Retread, tired, deodorant, roll on. Ah, it's a shame this sponsor wasn't in Cars 3. Oh, what can you do? What can you do? 79 in the front, right there with the grill and the headlights. The front teeth. They unfortunately didn't make the tires metallic like I thought they would. The red stripe is just leading into the back there. You know, as for metallic cars, it needs to have like a huge amount of space. Like there's barely any decals on it. Like, um... Cruz Ramirez, for example, or Marilyn. Those guys. It looks great like that. Even the sponsors are hard to read. I mean, look at that. Look at that on China Hall. Oh, well. Nitrate, Pistol Cup, Revolting, Mood, Springs, Altic, Gain, No Saw, Violin, Gaskets, Gasparin, Easy Idol, RPM, Load, Swicky, Pistons, Like Us, Retread, and Clutch Aid. Whew. That was hard to read. Retread right there. Of course, it has to be sponsored by Retread, because he is the Retread Racer. 79... Light year, retread. I reviewed him for Countdown to Christmas last year, not the metallic haul, but the regular hauling gas. If you'd like to see that review, I recommend you should check it out. Retread tire deodorant. Which I think is equivalent to speed stick in the cars universe, if you know what I'm if you know what I mean by speed stick, if you know what it is. You tread. Yep. It's not really much of a metallic purple. Let me shine it up close to a light. Not really seeing the metallic purple on there. Maybe it's just me. I don't know. 79. On the back there, 79 retread. Oh, I thought it came with like a chip or something. The back lights. Even the red stripe is still there. Same thing like what we've looked at before. Reach red tire deodorant. What's that weird decal right there? It's bleeding into the reach red logo. God. 79 on the roof right there. That looks spot on, the, the metallic paint. Retread tire deodorant. Lavender. They still say the same, the window bars. They don't even make them metallic. Which I don't mind anyways. N23A, made in Thailand, not China. We got two rivets on here. One at the back is just regular. Mixed with the purple, I think. And one is just a regular chrome. Whoa! Did I damage Hall? Did I damage him? Did I damage him? Phew! Thank God I didn't. Ways we're gonna compare him to some other metallic cars. We have a Lightning McQueen, of course, who is the first. Scavenger Hunt to be released of the 2018-2019 line. Along with the Piston Cup Racer to be metallic. Cal Weathers. You know, I really like the ice cold blue water. Compared to Hall and Gas, it's just like a, almost like a chrome. Just doesn't suit it. Just doesn't do it for me. Yeah, it just doesn't do it for me, the metallic hull. Yeah, the paint just doesn't do it for me. I don't get why they made it almost like chrome. Here's Rex Revler again. Not much metallic. One of my least favorite metallic scavenger hunt cars. That only the front is metallic. 50% of him is metallic. We also got Ryan Shields, who is the first 
Cars on Piston Cup Racer to be released in metallic. That's that just looks really neat, both of them, in metallic. Up next we have Dino Drafsky. The clutch a car three stock car. The front of them is metallic. Only the front is metallic, but they didn't even make, what's it called, um, this little part right here in the front metallic. They didn't even put the detail thing on the back here. Though they made the tires slightly metallic, the trim of the green is metallic. So I'll give them credit for that. Next, Bobby Swift. The Cars 3 Octane Gain Stock Car. Eh, kind of one of my favorites. But then again, the lavend the dark purple paint just almost looks like Marilyn, thinking about it. I'm sorry, but you just need to put more effort into your cars, Mattel, in order to make them good for metallic. Last is Jonas. I love, I just love that cherry red metallic. Along with the coffee brown, despite it not being metallic. I think was this was one of the best metallic cars Mattel has ever released. Oh, and by the way, if you'd like to see the review on Lightning, Cal, Ryan, Dino, Jonas, and Bobby Swift. You can check all of those reviews out if you haven't already. Alright, so we're going to put these cars back here for a moment. And this is the only... Retread stuff that Mattel has released, unfortunately. Oh yeah, we got to compare them real quick. Here they are on the hoods. So yeah, I think that pretty much concludes it for this review of Metallic Hall Gas. Again, in case L and M, if we want to go get them from there... I recommend you do so. All right, guys. So I'll see you in the next video, which I'll, which I assume will be probably hydraulic Florida Ramon. Just saying it. So, anyways, I might see you guys then. Might not. Goodbye. Thanks for watching, and as always, peace. <coughs> Hard luck, Hall. <laughs> Oh, you all!